Now to the latest on the Omicron variant discussed at the national level today by President Biden and tonight local doctors are answering some of your common questions. We're going to get to all of that in just a moment, but first a study released from the University of Florida shows that Omicron is projected to peak in February with a record number of infections, but fewer deaths than the Delta variant. On your sides, Robert Bradfield's taking a closer look at this study's major points tonight. Get used to the Omicron variant. This study from the University of Florida predicts an active beginning to 2022 with infections expected to peak in February. Most people believe now that it's highly infectious, it's going to spread. It's very hard to control. University of Florida professor Dr. Ira Longini co-authored this study released this week. According to Longini, infections could top 150,000 a day in Florida. That includes symptomatic and asymptomatic cases, with 30,000 of those projected to be confirmed through testing. I think people are, uh, after looking at these results, are, uh, are worried and um, uh, concerned and, and uh, you know, motivated to uh, to protect themselves and their families and neighbors. He says those projections aren't meant to create fear, but a realization of what's to come. There is some good news. Longini says the Omicron variant appears to create less severe infections, which could lead to much fewer deaths than the Delta variant. As we vaccinate more people and, uh, of course, they, they may get infected or even mildly ill, but they're much, much less likely to become a serious case. He cautions against visiting with anyone who is unvaccinated this holiday and says the vaccine and the booster increase protection for both you and those around you. Robert Bradfield, First Coast News, on your side. And if you would like to read that study, we have linked it to this story. Just head to firstcoastnews.com.